Hey YouTube, I want to do a little uh, explanation on uh, carburetors and uh, governors and you know how the uh, settings would be because I had some people had questions they said that they had issue with their machine uh, wasn't idling properly you know surging up and down if you look at the the throttle is moving back and forth questions about setting the governors and stuff like that and generally that's not something that you have to do or they had questions about or confusion about how to set the governor because they were saying that it was set at wide open throttle so this is your throttle looking at it from the inside that's closed and that's basically wide open, as wide open as I can make it, because it hits right here. Your setting on your governor is always going to be like this when the engine's off, because to get it started, you want to suck up as much fuel as you can. And then once that engine fires up, the governor would be attached here, which would be basically as the engine speeds up, pulling this back. So this would be, you know, decreasing the idle and increasing it. And it would do that basically uh, till it kept basically a constant, a constant speed on the engine. So if you have a carb and it's idling, you know, up and down, 90 probably not almost 99 percent of the time the issue is not with the governor because the governor generally is set at the factory and there's really not much you know that can go wrong with it uh, you know there is you know a possibility but generally anything what we would consider hunting surging you know surging would be up down up down with the idle hunting kind of is the same thing they're kind of just different terms for the same thing but usually that's a carburetor problem and it's usually a fuel problem so it's not it's not getting the fuel up into the into the carb to run the engine so uh, you know I've had a situation where I did have some idle problems and I'll link those into the video one was actually the the spring that goes onto the governor that was missing and another one was <clears throat> just the carb itself uh, was dirty but it was never never really required a governor adjustment so that being said I just wanted to illustrate this because as this as this throttle slows down there's, there's different ports in there right at the edge of that throttle plate may need to get some some other light in there to be able to see that, but right there you can kind of see a little tiny hole. Okay, so that would be when it's idling, when it's closed, when this throttle plate is closed, uh, that it still get fuel. But let me show you what the governor linkage looks like on a particular engine. So here. As you can see, that throttle plate is wide open when this engine is off. So it's wide open here, okay? As this speeds up, it's going to pull back, and the spring is going to try to pull it forward. So it's always going to try to sort of fight to go wide open, okay? As it slows down and as it speeds up, it's going to close up. The, Adjustment would be here on this spring as you moved it and loose loosen this tension You would change the idle or increase it the other way So that's basically how it works